expensive. The break will look like the same people. Oh, shut up, Kate. <laughs> I'm gonna buy you that bikini and that's fine. Silly girl. Oh my god, I can't wait to go back to school. <laughs> Me either. Just to see all my friends and stupid teachers like Miss Keating. <sighs> I bet you wanna learn. Oh, definitely. Seriously. Because my name is Snoop Doggy Doggy, I got like a rapper. Ah, uh, the stars look so bright tonight. Oh my god, it's like. <sighs> Kill it! Kill it! Mm. Smack it! <laughs> Ow! Oh my god, Kayla, you're okay. It fit me. <laughs> Do you want me to take you to the hospital? Oh no. Why not? The hospital is the only place we can go. Okay. Okay, let's go. Come on. <laughs> Breaking news. In the last 12 hours, five people in the northern region of Australia have been found to be suffering from an unknown disease of some sort. With painful symptoms such as vigorous shaking, tics and distressing panic attacks and paralysing of limbs, at the moment there's not knowing what this outbreak could be, but these people are being held in isolation in hospitals and are being studied and looked after. Hello? Hello? Ah, yes, I understand. Yes. Doctor! Doctor! We've got another case. Come on, come on. I'm on, I'm on my way. It's okay, Kate. I got a doctor. Oh no. This is not good. Come this way. Come this way. Quickly, quickly. Oh no. This is not good. What are your symptoms? Spider bite. Oh no. Oh no. Good. I need to take some tests. Okay. I'm going to take your heartbeat. Oh no, this is not good. It is very complicated. Complicated. I need to. You're going to be okay. Can you hear me? Kate? Miss Kate? Can you hear me? To be exact. This is very complicated and serious disease. I'm sending email and results to National Disease Board of Australia. We need to know what this is. So, um, we found out from previous studies that uh, Dr. Kate and I did, and the evidence that we have recorded of all the spider bites, that um, this disease has actually been caused from the Katipo spider vaccine that went wrong because 
it was a breeding vaccine that was meant to prevent the Katipo spider from becoming extinct, but actually um, caused the spiders to be to have a virus put into them. And uh, this the sort of pathogen that is involved with this disease is the virus. And um, so we found out that the symptoms of this bite is you know, twitching and pale face and distress and panic attacks. And um, although the physical effects seem very similar to other things that it could be, it's a it actually can go on for two or four weeks until death or treatment. So it's actually a very uh, serious cause that if you don't get treated straight away, you can die very, very quickly. Uh, the prevention and the treatment that we have at the moment is just an EpiPen to slow it down, but scientists are actually trying to find an antidote to um, you know, save all these people from dying. Uh, the defence um, systems, the first uh, is skin mucus, and the second is white blood cells, the third is antibodies. So the defence that um, this disease is brought into people, the defence is hasn't been stopped by skin mucus or white blood cells, it has to be stopped by something outside of the body. These past few weeks have brought tragedy to Australia. We've just discovered the causes of this disease swiping our nation. To prevent any more mishaps, stay away from Katibro spiders. Scientists are still working hard on an antidote which should be released very soon. We are very unfortunate to have lost all those who have been killed by this horrible virus. David! Are we ready? Ah. Hey, I just met you and I love you. Oh, please, oh, please be my prisoner. Please!